just a quick um, update on the uh, day trading, swing trading. I closed over the weekend. I left. Um, I've got a few options. Actually, not code. Okay. I've got a few options, and um, I try option trades. Yeah, open over the weekend. So when the market closed Friday evening, I left the trades as they were. I didn't. As a day trader, you'd have actually closed those, those trades. And um, excuse me. You do actually, my okay. code. Um, as a day trade, a day trade would have closed those cl those trades down, and then started this morning, this afternoon, with a clean, with a, with a, a new balance, and have to do the research for new trades and get the the, the market breakouts in a way. But because I left mine open, my trades open, they were open all weekend. Yeah. So this afternoon, what happens is you log in your account. And your balance changes. It will change down, or it will change down, or it will change up. Yeah. So I've just logged into my account, and the trades that I trade, which is options, I was in. Yeah, the trades that I was I was in. The balance I'd lost. I'd lost this morning. I checked it before the market opened this afternoon. And I was, I'd lost four hundred pounds off the balance, which is compared to the balance, it's nothing. Yeah. It's um well, the balance I'm trading. Okay, so I'm trading in a practice account, but I would be trading the same way in a real account. But um, but I can't take without my domain to do that. <laughs> but the um, yes, yeah, so I lost I lost four hundred quid over the weekend up until this morning before the markets opened, and I've just logged in. I've done absolutely nothing, nothing, and the balance is already two thousand four hundred pounds up. Yeah, in five minutes, right? Yeah. So I could now. So day trader would would take that, would bank that, close the trades, bank it, and then start again. But then if you if you do that, if you close your trades and you start, and you bank bank your profit. Then you've got to start again. Then you've got to look for other trades. But if you're already in the best trade, why, why bother? So like now, you see, you, you, you don't get to see this side of day trading, swing trading, if you're just if you just watch day traders, because all they do is just they buy the stock at a certain price and they usually short sell. They go down, that's it. Then they're out. Then they go in again. Buy up, then they're out. Another trade, more profit, profit twice, yeah. And then they buy again, little short series of sequences, about five or seven sequences, with volume, and they're out. But when you let the the market flow, yeah, you um you see how the market reacts because you're not you're not going to see it. By this, yes, you can look at your trades and you can see how it's your trades have performed, but you're only buying little small parts of the the, the curve, yeah. Profit, profit, profit. Lots of lots of little profits. <coughs> That's a profit. Then you bank, you bank. <laughs> But by doing the day trading, you see how it's going to react. So you don't, when you when you ride the big waves, you don't mind riding the big waves. You haven't got to stay in the harbour, have you? You stand the <laughs> day trading is like staying in the harbour because they don't want to go, they, don't, they don't want to ride the big waves in the open sea. But when you can ride the big waves and ride any big wave that comes in the open sea. The, the open sea is not a problem with it. The swing trading options is like the open sea. But you've got to be able to leave your trades open overnight and not really worry what happens to them. But you have to design your portfolio that you're only using I don't know some I don't know really, so like you 
you're only using, say, like this much. I don't know. You're only using. You're only using this much of your balance to trade. So all this bit here. So when if if the someone is like when he was on a beach, you can stand on the sand, but and the, and the, and the tide goes out. Right. When it comes in, you don't want to get wet. Yeah. Which is effectively the the the. the, the the stops coming in against your trades or absorbing it's when they absorb like it's the, the waves coming in against the harbour and they smash against the harbour and big waves you don't want that to your account because that's busting your account effectively so even right now I've got but there but it'll go right now my balance is like yes I've made the two I've made up this morning, up until just now, two and a half grand. That may go down. Because sometimes, it, it, when you swing trade options, it goes like that. Yeah. And you think, do I take the profit? No, I'll let it go. And it goes back to where it started again. Right? Yeah. So you've lost all that profit you could have took. But, and then that goes down towards pivot, pivot points. See, my pivot point, and I'll do this, the pivot point is up here. Yeah, if you got a pivot point here, if you see you've got a pivot point here, your trade will swing like that. Yeah, but then once you get a high, once you make a enough profit, then you close your your trades, and then you rebuy them at a higher pivot point. Your trade, your your swing goes like that. Yeah, and then when you can buy at the top and, and the big. But you can't trade this way when you have a small account because chances are you, you're going to bust your account. So you have to get out. From, it's almost like going from the sand into the little shallow part of the water of the sea. You need to be able to swim in the big waves. You have to when you're trading. But you can't do that. You can't, have to, you can't trade the same way in a small account as you can with a big account. Let's just say you've got, let's say for example you're on 200,000. Let's just, let's just, let's just dream. You're on 200,000, let's just say you're on 200,000. Then you've got nice big, you can, you can afford to lose 50 grand. And you can make 50 to 100 grand. Yeah? You can, on 200 grand, you can afford to lose 100 grand and still have a trading fund. And you can afford to make and you get if you double your two hundred grand, you made four, isn't it? It takes no more. It's it's take it's it's just as easy to make two hundred grand on a two hundred grand budget than doubling a hundred pounds on a small account, doubling it to two hundred pounds. It takes no no extra effort. The stock market doesn't care why it doubles. It's the individual that puts the balance in for the stock market to double. If that makes sense to you. But you'd have to know that to actually know that that's the case. But, and you've got to be able to trade confidently. And you don't trade that very confidently when you've put £100 in and that's all you've got to put in. And you know that you, you, you hear so much about 76% of people, day traders, lose money on in, in the stock market. And they do. 24% make a bit. And the top 5% make quite a bit, and the top 1% make an absolute fortune. <laughs> You've just got to get yourself into a situation where you are in the top part of the, the day trade. And that takes screen time. Look at the charts for the chart. That's another thing. Today, I made two, 2,400 quid on opening, although I'll leave it in there and just see what it makes. It might do, I might lose money, because it might just bounce back. But... I've not looked at a single day trade chart today. I have had to have the, the four screens and all, the, all this chart, this chart and that chart and every other chart. Don't need it. If you're swing trading, you don't need it. Day trading, you might, you do. Because it's by the half a second or whatever it is. The swing trading options, you don't need any of that. I've done no research today. My trades made me money in my practice account 
by me doing nothing, but I had to be. You can't make money on the gap up if you haven't left your trades open overnight. And to do that, you've got to have confidence in the market where it is. And or be able to trade your way out of whatever to the stock market gives you. And I can. So I'm not, I'm not fussed overnight. And then day trading, you 